<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, life and boy here. And today I am bringing you another in uh, the Tales from Life and Land. This one's going to be a little bit different. This is a little scary. Um, <laughs> well, I'll give you a little bit of background. For a little while, I lived in Tennessee, and I drove an expediter truck. And I'll tell you what an expediter does. Basically, I was uh, I used a I was driving a one-ton truck with a box on the back. A one-ton truck is basically a pickup. You 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 probably seen them. Uh, it's the pickups that have the four tires on back, two on each side. Um, <laughs> anyway, and what an expediter does is basically do the same thing as a big truck driver, uh, only I did little bitty loads, uh, whatever, you know, it had to, of course, it had to fit in the back of a pickup, basically, with a box on the back. I mean, you know, a big, I hope that you understand what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, anyway... Well, and during this doing this job, I would go from uh, I would go from Tennessee and go to several different states. And this particular time, I was going to Virginia, out near Virginia Beach. And I'm gonna tell you, that is a beautiful, beautiful area. This, uh, but at this particular point, I was driving down the road. I was, I was out on the highway. It was late at night. There was nothing around me. I was just listening, you know, cruising down the road, listening to my, uh, some uh, book on tape. And, um, well, I'm just cruising down the road and then I notice a pair of headlights coming at me and I didn't really think anything at about it at first but then I realized I'm on a divided highway and I cannot see the other side of the highway so I pulled uh, so I switched lanes over into into the slow lane and it was just in time because this dude or this person nearly took off the mirror of my truck. He was traveling the wrong way down a down a highway at a very high rate of speed. And um, well, and I, you know, he nearly killed both of us. Well, anyway, so, um, yeah, after that, I pulled over to the side of the road. I called the cops. They knew, uh, I, I guess they, they weren't, they didn't know exactly where the person was, but they knew that that person, that there was a person out there doing that. They, uh, you know, they, um, I guess they didn't know, like I said, I guess they just didn't know exactly where he was because I didn't see any of them, but they knew that, uh, they knew that that person was, was out there and I guess they were trying to do whatever, whatever they could. But I mean, I, I sat there for a minute. I called my brother-in-law who, you know, who, who, uh, worked for the same company. And I, I mean, I was sitting there, I I was shaking so bad I couldn't steer. <laughs> But, um, hopefully they caught the guy before he hurt anybody and, uh, or, you know, killed anybody. But, uh, yeah, that was, <laughs> that was a, that was a scary night. Anyway, that is it for this story. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. <laughs> Drive safe and be watch and be mindful of other drivers. Anyway, thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day. Laughing boy out.